Anyang noobs. Korea is a land of fantastic culture, rich silks, and a callous disregard for international copyright law. Korea is also a fantastic place to find delicious, if not spicy, food. So tonight, get ready for some soul food as we do my take on traditional Korean bulgogi. Bulgogi should not be confused with Bolshanin from Night Court. The word literally means fire meat, and it describes marinated meat that's cooked quickly. God, I miss Night Court. First, cut some sirloin into strips. Bulgogi can also be made with pork, but beef is traditional. Also, cows have it coming. They know why. In a dish, mix one and a half tablespoons of rice wine, three tablespoons of sugar, and a tablespoon of molasses. Did you know in 1919 there was a flood of hot molasses that killed 21 people in the city of Boston? If prepared correctly, however, bulgogi won't kill anyone. Unless Kim Jong-il gives the order. Then add together six tablespoons of soy sauce, three cloves minced garlic, one teaspoon sesame oil, and a dash of pepper. I recommend adding about three chopped scallions to enhance the flavor, much like the Matrix of Leadership enhanced hot rod in the original Transformers movie. Add the beef, mix well, and cover. Marinate in the fridge for at least an hour, though overnight would be awesome too. An hour is the perfect time for you to catch the latest installment of your favorite Korean soap opera. Or you could prepare your presentation. Like almost any Korean dish, bulgogi goes well with traditional kimchi. Spicy fermented cabbage, kimchi is yet another Korean product bearing the name Kim. Plan ahead to serve the finished meal over a healthy and attractive bed of lettuce leaves, which, like a bed at Motel 8, should be washed thoroughly. Aha! Thanks to the miracle of questionable editing, our meal is marinated. Cook the meat quickly in a hot pan. These giant chopsticks are perfect for stir-frying meat or for eating the world's largest dumpling! <laughs> Near the end of the cooking process, you can also toss in some sliced mushrooms and onions to help soak up the sweet, sweet juices. Serve with rice and you've got a sweet meat meal that's nice. This homestyle Korean meal is perfect for you to share with your friends and family. It's easy and cheap, giving you a lot of Bangkok for your buck. What? Bangkok's not in Korea, honey. It isn't? Son of a bitch. <laughs>